Yo guys, it's boy King70 back with another video before we get into this video. I just want to remind you all the other kings and queens and I hope you all are having a very, very blessed day. And I'm back with another Giants franchise episode. It's going to be episode number four as we are the 0-2 Giants taking on the 1-1 Atlanta Falcons. We've been struggling so far through our first two games. Uh, it's very different from the start that we had with the Bengals. The Bengals and my other franchises were 2-0. So we're 0-2 here. We desperately want to get our first victory. But before we do get into that game, I do want to say thank you for all the comments, suggestions, the likes, the subs. And if you are watching this video, drop a like. And if you're feeling extra, extra generous, drop a sub. Be greatly appreciated. But nonetheless... Let's not mess around. We're 80 overall. The Falcons are 74 overall. Let's go ahead and get into this ball game. All right, we start the game on the defensive side of the football. I got Jabril Peppers, a sub linebacker, like you guys told me to implement him there. Can we get stops? Is the important part, though. They're taking a deep shot. They're testing a door. Jackson, first play of the game, and we, he goes up there and bats the ball away off Calvin Ridley, but uh, they're really testing us with a deep shot. First play, very, very ambitious from them. Second and 10 now, though. Come on, we got to get one stop, boys. I know it's already 0-0, but I just got a feeling that it's going to be tough. And we get a sack. Who is that? Julian Love. Julian Love gets in there to make the play. We're going to get. We're gonna have a third and 17 now for the Falcons. It's a very promising start for our defense, considering last week the, the disastrous performance we put out there against uh, Ryan Fitzpatrick and his Washington football team. But we're going to drop back into coverage. Rush three. I probably shouldn't do this. Probably should blitz. They're going to go with the halfback slip screen. This is cannot. It does not. It does not pick up anywhere near the first down. The, and the Falcons are going to go ahead and punt it over to us. And let's see if Daniel Jones can make plays happen and give us the early lead. First play of the game is going to be a handoff to Saquon Barkley. Saquon Barkley has a lot of space and room. He picks up nine yards on that rush. Uh, this game, I really want to focus on getting Daniel Jones just locked in. Mentally just eliminate all mistakes that he's been making so far in the first couple of games and then we got kenny Galladay right there it's a good catch holds on to it doesn't fumble we get it to the 42 yard line one pass one completion for daniel jones looking good let's see how long this uh 100 completion percentage could, could last and we're gonna have Evan ingram also back to back really good plays to start off the game honestly this game is it's uh it's scaring me a little how well things are kind of starting off for us I'm waiting for us to crash and burn. I don't know when it's going to be. We got Kenny Galladay. That's another good throw. It was inaccurate, but Kenny Galladay with his range um, is very, very tall. And he's, his, his, his catch radius is very large. Was able to get down on the ground and make that play. And then here, who are we going to have? We're going we're gonna to have Kenny Galladay. Cross field. Safe catches, Kenny. He safe catches. It goes out of bounds. It's a 19-yard line. What is going on right now? I'm, I'm, I'm uh, very... Very confused why we're performing so well. Uh, this is still all mad, and trust me, I wouldn't just like give up on a challenge like that. We're gonna have X, and there we go. That's where things go. Uh, they go wrong for us, you know. Richard Sherman, um, isn't he in, in, in jail or something? Richard Sherman, you're on the field. Okay, well, uh, yeah, we start off our drive throwing a nice interception. They're taking another deep shot, attacking Dory Jackson, and this time it was almost caught. Almost caught. That was the same exact play that they came at us. Third and eight, though, for the Falcons. Last time I will drop back in coverage. This time I'm bringing a blitz. Somebody get home. It's over the middle of the field. It's going to be completed to Kyle Pitts. I go with the big hit stick with Logan Ryan, but he's still able to pick up the first. Now, Matt Ryan, 2 of 4 for 25 yards. Matt Ryan has orchestrated a beautiful drive. He's taking it down to our 15-yard line. Our defense was looking promising to start the game, but we're going back to our, our you know, our midseason form, and we give up a touchdown right there. Just why is it every single play? There's at least five, six people. Well, it was a simple drag and space. It was like just curl routes, and they were just got open though somehow. It's it's honestly unbelievable at this point. But Koo for the extra point, he makes it, and we're down seven nothing. Last time it led to the oh, Saquon Barkley on the carry. Saquon Barkley going to get to the outside. He can't. He fumbles. Oh, he fumbled out of bounds. Oh, lucky for us. Harmon was there to make the tackle. Daniel Jones back to pass. We're going to have Evan Ingram wide open. Daniel Jones makes the throw over there. We're going to go with a no huddle though. 
Daniel Jones basically having a perfect game. He's five or six. That one throw, the interception, of course. And Saquon Boga is going to be wide open. We're going to catch up to the run. He stays in bounds, goes upfield, gets caught by Deion Jones. We're going to keep with the snow huddle. And I'm going to run the same play, red zone scissors. See if it keeps working. If Saquon Boga keeps getting open, he's still going to be open. He got both in bounds. He did to the 16-yard line. We got the we got the momentum back on our side barely, but at least it's on our side now. Daniel Jones gonna pass it again, and we're gonna lob it. We get hit as we get sacked. We throw out of the sack, and it's gonna be another second interception on the day. That was gonna be a touchdown. I was gonna lob it over Deion Jones. Saw Kenny Galladay wide open making the slant, but the offensive line can't uh, protect Daniel Jones for more than two seconds. It is what it is, unfortunate. Third and nine for the Falcons, please. Please, just get the stop. I really want the stop. I want to get the ball back and score. Can we get it? They throw it deep. It's going to be overthrown. There we go. Overthrown. We force the fourth down. And we're going to get the ball back. And this time, we're going to score. And we're not going to throw another interception. It's not happening. I, I refuse to let it happen. Saquon Barkley. Saquon Barkley's off to the races. Saquon Barkley makes the last man miss. And that's exactly what we need. We needed a little Saquon Barkley. Oh. I went for the celebration almost too early, but we just needed a quick Saquon Barkley touchdown. A quick tholt, a bolt of lightning out of nowhere. Saquon Barkley is unreal. We already know 85.1 rushing on that on that one play. And we're going to tie it up 7-7. Saquon Barkley, you're amazing, bro. You're amazing. When Daniel Jones is struggling, we always got Saquon Barkley to rely on. And I think that's what I have to do more often. I just have to run the football 20, 25 times a game and then throw it 20 times a game. I have to be a very even split. I think that's the plan moving forward. Well, Mike Davis throws off three Giants players, and he's still going. He was about to throw off with Dory Jackson. Mike Davis, what are you, like a 60 overall? Are you doing that to our players, bro? It's just, that's just all Madden kicking in right there. They're like, all Madden's like, yo, the Falcons need to win this game. The Giants need to start 0-3. We can't have it any other way. And Mike Davis is going to be wide open. Tiptoe catch at the sideline. Uh, I run zone, they burn the zone. I run man, they burn me man. There's just no winning. There's no winning. Just like that was at two plays and they're already at our 28-yard line. You can't beat all Madden for some reason. Only if you're the Bengals, though. They throw it short. Like, why? Well, bro, but... to make it make sense. Make it make sense, though. Let's go to this replay. He's covered. He's covered. Who is this? Xavier McKinney. Explain to me. Why are you running to the outside if the ball's already in the air? It's going to your man that you have him right here. But no, let's just run all the way to the other man that the ball is not going to. I really, I don't understand, man. I can't control all, th all 12, all 11 people on the field. So, I don't know. I'm doing what I can. Make the tackle. Good job. Say Crowder. Calvin really goes nowhere on that rush, but... It's, it's getting frustrating at this point because I can run cover two and cover the flats that they've been wanting to throw all day But then this zone is, is exposed over here Logan Ryan's never gonna make the adjustment and go over there The only way we could get the ball back is if we sack them or if they do what they just did and run two Dumb plays back to back ran run up the middle right right into our hands to make it a third and 11 And maybe even here they could still convert potentially if they beat this zone which they shouldn't. We have it all covered and we sack them. Let's go. Good sack, Aziz. That's the second sack of the day. But that's just what it's going to come down to. We're going to have to get sacks. And we're going to have to make sure we cannot allow opponents to run the football on us. Because passing-wise, you could pass it wherever you want against us. Cool. Squeezes that one in there. And it is going to be 10-7 to with three minutes left in the second quarter. Daniel Jones back to pass. We're going to have Evan Ingram on the drag route. Comes, ooh. Gets hit hard, bro. Gets hit really hard. Look at Daniel Jones. He's had a perfect day except those two interceptions. 8 for 10 nonetheless. And we're going to have Evan Ingram again. Daniel Jones able to get rid of it. He gets pushed out of bounds. Second and 10 for Daniel Jones. We're going to have Saquon broken on this halfback slip screen. We are as the man falls down. Get that block. We get the block. He gets tackled forward to the 48-yard line. What we're going to do here, strong flood. Who's going to be up with Galladay? I like Galladay on this route. I love Gal down the route. Safe catch it. Look at that. Strong. Use his body to block to block out the, the corner and make the catch as if you were like boxing someone out on a on a rebound in basketball. But we're not gonna throw the football too much. We're gonna go back and get it on the ground. Saquon Barkley. Saquon Barkley. 
he broke that one tackle and he was out. He's got five rushes, 123 yards, and that's going to take us to the two-minute warning. Third and two. Looks like the Falcons are bringing the all-out blitz against us, and they are. We're going to have Shepard over the middle of the field catch after the run. Okay, good, Shepard. He picks up the first down to the 17-yard line. We're going no huddle on them. I want to run this football with Saquon. I do not want to go and throw another interception. The blocking is pretty decent by Thomas and Hernandez. We pick up four yards. Going to stay with the no huddle. Run mesh. Maybe we're going to have Ingram coming across the field. We are going to have Ingram coming across the field. Catch up to the run. Catch up to the run. Safe. I don't know why I said Saquon. I'm going to say Evan Ingram almost put, stretched his hands out to score the touchdown on the play. But he couldn't. And I am going to run this football again with Saquon Barkley. Not risking it at all with Daniel Jones. Saquon's going to get blown up in the backfield to the three-yard line. And now run slants on the three-yard line. Probably shouldn't, but I'm going to. Nobody's open. Shepard, he would have got the touchdown, but Daniel Jones was just under way too much pressure. I guess we're going to have to run stick here. Or do I run it in? I don't like any option here. If I'm being honest, I don't like any option. Oh, but well, we're going to have Kenny Galladay in the back of the end zone. Let's go. We score another touchdown. Daniel Jones gets his first passing touchdown on the day to Kenny Galladay. Oh, I ain't a rapper, though. But can we take a four-point lead? And that's going to be good. Up and good right down the middle. 14-10, 55 seconds left in the first half. The Falcons have 12 seconds left on the clock. They have Kyle Pitts open. They're going deep. Adoree Jackson, Calvin really, oh wait, I thought he made the catch and bounds, are they going to booth review that? They're not going to booth review that, Calvin really looked to have scored a touchdown, but they're not calling it a touchdown, 7 seconds left, please, pick that off, let's go Adoree Jackson, very well done, 4 seconds left, they have to try kicking the field goal, 35 yards at the 35 yard line, can Koo go ahead and give it his all on this kick, taking his time, the kick is up and that's definitely going to be good, right down the middle, and we have a 14-13 ball game at halftime. And if I do remember correctly, we are receiving the ball to start the second half. What do we want? We want to defend the short pass. They've been killing us on the short pass. But we are going to re receive the ball to start the second half. We score another touchdown. We'll be in a very comfortable position. Third and three on our first drive of the second half. Saquon Barkley coming out the backfield here. And it's going to be Saquon Barkley coming out the backfield. Runs a man over. And he picks up the first down. Daniel Jones, 15-20. These have been very accurate, except those two interceptions. I would say, I don't know if both, I can't remember both of them. I think one of them might have been my fault, the other one not really. But uh, you, if you guys have been a fan of mine for a while, you guys know I throw a lot of bad passes, a lot of interceptions. Um, it just, it is what it is, and all Madden seems to always have the perfect coverage against most plays. We're going to scramble out with Daniel Jones. We have a lot of space and time. We're going to step up, don't fumble it. We don't fumble it. He might have got the first down there, and he does get the first down. We're going to go with a little bit of play action here as the clock winds down. Oh, look at Kenny Galladay. The separation on that route. Kenny Galladay. Dude, he's been coming up very, very big this game. I really have enjoyed using him this game. Six receptions for 75 yards speaks for itself. Saquon, Saquon, Saquon to the races again. Saquon Barkley. He can't beat that last tackle, but he takes it to the one-yard line. And Saquon, he definitely deserves to finish off this play. Come on, Saquon. He's got a superstar X-Factor activated. I'm going to audible this to the left side with Mitchell Schwartz and Andrew Thomas. Get the push that we need. Saquon, he doesn't get it. He doesn't get it, but we're going to go. No huddle. No worries, Saquon. No worries. I'll give you another try. Please, Saquon. Saquon, he gets in there. He does get in there. Let's go. Saquon Barkley into the end zone. And we're going to go back up to what, an 8-point lead? We are going to have an 8-point lead pending this extra point. And the extra point looks like it's going to be good. Right down the middle, let's go. 21-13, 4 minutes left in the third quarter. And we're going to sack Matt Ryan. Is that as easy again? It's not as easy as Dexter Lawrence. I was playing perfect user D with Jabril Peppers on the slant routes. Matt Ryan had no idea nowhere to go for him. Nobody, there was probably people open, but I was just confusing him on my user play right there with Jabril, the sub linebacker, our new sub linebacker. We're third and 16, can't give up this play. Oh, I got Kyle Pitts. And they're going to throw it short over to Russell Gage. And that's not, that's not, that's not going to be enough yards. It's not going to be enough yards for first down. They're going to go ahead and punt it over to us. And can we extend the lead? That would be amazing right now. Second and four for Daniel Jones. Can somebody get open on this play? Oh, we're going to have Kadarius Tony with space. And it's an inaccurate throw. 
by Daniel Jones. Kadarius Tony was so open right there, third and four. Honestly, I'm gonna run that exact play back. Audible Kadarius Tony to a slant because he was so open right there. I don't know what Daniel Jones was thinking with that pass. Kadarius, and it's another inaccurate pass back to Kadarius. I'm gonna have to go ahead and punt this. I'm not. I can't go for it on fourth and four at our own 29 yard line. They're gonna take a deep shot on James Bradbury. James Bradbury swats that one away. You're not doing that to a 90 overall, James Bradbury. He honestly should have picked it off, but we'll we'll take the swat down. Second and ten for the Falcons. Our defense, they've been they've been definitely stepping it up here later in the game. Mike Davis gonna go out of bounds for a quick three yard gain. Can we stop the Falcons again? Third and seven for them. Please, boys. This stop will mean the world. If we get this stop, I got confidence in our offense putting points up on the board. They're going to throw an audible on the right side, one of the receivers. And it's going to be completed on James Brad. Who is that? Number four. Is it Taji Sharp? I don't know who that is, but James Bradbury, you can't be giving up that type of play. The Falcons are at our 13-yard line. It's second and seven for them. I don't even know what to do at this point. Nothing has been seeming to work. We're getting pressure, though. Danny Shelton. And who is that? Danny Shelton and O'Shane Zimenez. X-Men combined for the sacks. It's going to be third and 16 for Matt Ryan. I'm telling you. In order for us to succeed, we need to be able to get pressure on the quarterback. Because for some reason, our coverage just isn't the best. I'm going to switch to a man right here. A man look. Please stop him. Stop him. Stop him. He throws that out of bounds. Let's go. Fourth and 16, we're going to force the Falcons to kick a field goal, and our 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 lead remains intact. You know, if they scored a touchdown, they easily could have uh, tried to convert a two-point conversion. But nonetheless, Koo, he's going to make that easy. 21-16, we need to score points in this possession. It's going to be a handoff to Saquon Barkley. Saquon Barkley makes a man miss. He goes, chugs forward. Did he get the first down, though? It's going to be third and one. Not too big of a fan of that one. I don't really feel comfortable running the football on this play, but we're going to have to. we got to pick up the one yard. And Saquon, I think his X Factor led him to getting the one yard. All right, first and seven, he did get the one yard. Even though we didn't move from the third and seven yard line, he was able to get it. But Saquon out the backfield, he's got his route highlighted. Can he get open? Saquon, Saquon. Saquon Barkley, Saquon Barkley, Saquon Barkley. It's overthrown just a little bit by Daniel Jones. What a play that would have been. But let's keep the ball on the ground for now. Let's try picking up five, six yards right here. Make it a third and manageable, hopefully. Saquon, what do you what do you got for me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got nothing for me. So, all right, we're in a position I really didn't want to be in at all. We're gonna. I didn't want to even run that play. You know, play action. Kenny Gallo, they come back to the ball, maybe? Or Daniel Jones? We hit A out of the backfield. It's going to be Evan Ingram. Evan Ingram? Obviously can't make a man miss. We take it to the 40-yard line. All right. We're going to punt this to the Falcons. We're going to pin them deep in their zone. That's the game plan. Ride Dixon. Give us a good punt right here. Please, Riley Dixon. All right. The power is not even that good. Is it, though? He's going to save catch us. He's not going to save catch it. I go for the hit stick. And we get the hit stick and we fumble. The user hit stick fumble worked. Let's go. What a hit stick. Who was that? A lot. Was that Xavier McKinney that forced the fumble? Hold on. I need, I need an instant replay on that one. What a play. I missed the first user. Oh, let's zoom in. I missed the first user hit stick with Xavier McKinney. And then I think it was, was it Crowder? Crowder just blew him up. And we get the football back. Tay Crowder, take a bow, man. You you just saved the game, honestly. You really, really did right there. Now we could ice it. Like, we got... All right. Um, <clears throat> you know, guys, who likes uh, easy wins, you know? I don't like I don't like easy wins. It's Richard Sherman should be in... Isn't he in legal issues right now? He shouldn't even be on this roster. <sighs> Terrible read from me. Terrible read. Terrible, 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 terrible for me. I always like to make things interesting, though, you know, guys? It's kind of my thing. No way. There's no way. We're obviously... There's zero... I will bet my fucking life that we don't stop them here. 
I I read it. I read it perfectly. I read it perfectly. And Blake Martinez. I read it. I read it. Per you could not have read that play any more perfectly. Any more perfectly. What overall is Mike Davis? What overall is he? Bro, I can't believe I just threw this game. I literally threw the game. I folded. I folded. I threw it. I threw the game. We had it. Why did I pass with Daniel Jones? Why do? Why am I obsessed with passing the football? And not accurately, not good. I don't make good decisions at all when I pass the football. Like, right, Saquon Barkley, I couldn't have just ran that before. We had to score a touchdown. We have to. Obviously, we have to. You guys obviously know that. What am I even talking about? Evan Ingram. Pro Deion Jones, you're not even looking at the quarterback. How do you even know he's throwing there, bro? How, you, how do you even, how can you tell? How do you know, Deion Jones? Saquon. Saquon. Good Saquon. Let's go. To the 49 yard line we go. We at least at least need a field goal. At least, bro. We could we could do that. We could at least get a field goal for sure. But I want to score this touchdown. Scramble Daniel Jones. Get the block, Saquon. Get the block. Get the block. Alright, he goes out of bounds to the 43 yard line. I'm not even gonna edit this whole part until we score the touchdown. I'm not editing this video. Alright, second and four. 43 yard line. I love this play a lot. It works quite often. We have Shepard. Shepard safe catch. Nice Shepard. Good separation on the corner. On Sherman. The corner that's just made every single perfect play under the sun up until this point. Daniel Jones, come on. I have Y. I didn't want to throw. Good. Good patience right there. That DB tried baiting me right there. He tried baiting me so hard. So hard. We got to make sure. Are we on true clock? We are on true clock. Okay. Clock, oh, oh, I have nobody. I really wanted to run this football. I don't want to run it with Daniel Jones. I don't want to QB draw it. I will stick it. Hit Corey Clement. <clears throat> Corey Clement. Almost intercepted. Literally almost intercepted by number 21. Whoever whoever that is, bro. Whoever that is. Saquon Barkley is just not in the game. Is he injured or something? Or is he tired? This is, the, this is not the right time for Saquon Barkley to come out. Kenny Galladay, inaccurate throw from Daniel Jones. Daniel Jones, please just make an accurate throw. Please, that was the ball game right there. That was game for us. That was it, Daniel. That was it. And you screwed it. You screwed us over, Daniel Jones. Why? Open. Don't fumble. Okay, good. All right, we're going to let the, the clock run. We're going to force the Falcons to call timeouts. We hand this off to Saquon Barkley. Saquon, he's going to get in. All right, we get in there. So a minute 20 something left on the clock. The, the Falcons have all timeouts remaining. Well, if we make this extra point. All right, they have to score a touchdown. They have to score a touchdown. Three timeouts, a minute 13. We got this. We got this. Nice. Saquon Barkley, you're a beast, bro. You're literally, you're literally an animal, bro. I love you. All right, first and 10. Falcons have it at the 47-yard line, 50 seconds. We should get stops, boys. That's fine. Hit him outside. Hit him outside. Waste time to the 40-yard line. No touchdown. No touchdown. Do not allow a touchdown. Please. I'm begging. I'm literally begging. No touchdown. Okay. They keep it in bounds. Nice. Don't allow him to throw it out. Well, they should call a timeout. All right. They call a timeout. They have two left. 30 seconds. We're going to sack Matt Ryan, and that should be the bowl game. The Falcons take another timeout. Oh, my gosh. We're going. We're switching back and forth. Me and Matt Ryan, we're switching back and forth with our audibles. I ended up going with a blitz there. Oh, I don't want a blitz here. All right. Let me let me get. Uh, I'm going to just drop back in coverage any way I can. Okay. They throw it short. Nice. They throw it short to Mike Davis. Gets out of bounds at the 41-yard line. It's going to be third and 23. Go with the sand blitz. Have three bubbles back here. We got Ryan. All right, let me just control over here. Adore Jackson. Do not let us get beat over the top. Then go with the halfback slip screen. Don't let him get out of bounds. Nice. We do not allow him to get out of bounds. They take their last and final timeout. I don't know how much time is left on the clock, but you no know, cover three sky. Okay, this is it. This is for the win, boys. 14 seconds. Fourth and 14. Can we secure our first victory of the season? They go deep. Don't get, let's go, Xavier McKinney with the interception with nine seconds that falls into the end zone. And that's going to be the game. I feel so relieved, guys. I feel so relieved. We're going to call a knee. 
Danny Jones, just don't fumble the, the, the hand, the, the, the toss from the center or something. All right. There we go. We've won the game. The clock winds down. 28 to 24 victory. Stressful. Stressful to say the least. Definitely my doing for sure. I definitely did not play well as the quarterback. 58 rating for Daniel Jones. 22 completions, 34 attempts. One touchdown, three interceptions. 237. Matt Ryan had himself a day. 30 of 38. 382. Rushing the football, Saquon Barkley came in and was the hero. 17 for 185, 10.8 yards per carry, and three touchdowns. He had the hat trick of touchdowns. Receiving the football, Kenny Galladay really stood out. 6 of 75 with a touchdown. Evan Ingram did really good too. Same with Saquon Barkley. Uh, Darius Slayton, he did his thing. He got that crucial catch at the end, as well as Shepard, you know, some plays here and there. Defensively speaking, who led our team in tackles? Logan Ryan did Jabril as well. Tackles for loss, two for Aziz. Two for Dexter, two for O'Shane. Sex, 1.5 for Aziz. Interceptions, two for Sherman. One for McKinney, one for Deion Jones. And that is going to be the episode, guys. If you did overall enjoy it, this win that we just got, make sure to drop a like, comment, subscribe. And it's been your boy, KingStar7. I'm out. Peace.